in the night, Mother, have arrived. Your presence here signals a welcome return to tradition. Oh, what a kind and wise wizard you are! Sure to earn our lady's favor. You and the night, Mother, are of course welcome here, sister. And you will be afforded the respect deserving of your position as keeper. Oh, yes, yes, yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you! You must go to the city of Markarth and speak with the apothecary's assistant. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the Black Sacrament. Her name is Muiri. Just the keeper. I keep. I look after our matron, you see. The night mother. I keep her clean and protected and <laughs> happy. But I am not the listener. Oh no. There is no listener. Not yet. But someday. Someday I pray that one will come to hear her. <laughs> the listener is the only person the Night Mother speaks to. It is the highest honor attainable by a member of the Dark Brotherhood. Stay safe. I don't like mimes, minstrels, thespians, acrobats, jugglers, troubadours, or tumblers. Flutists give me a headache. I particularly hate jesters. As a rule, I'm also not crazy about the corpses of old women. For the Night Mother, I'll make an exception. But Astrid is the only mistress I serve. Two hundred years ago, I would have laid down my life for the Unholy Matron. But that age is long since past. Astrid is my matron now. The witless fool and his pet corpse? Take a guess. You go speak with Muiri. I've got to deal with the Night Mother and her little clown. Why are you looking at me like that? The Dark Brother. Oh, oh. I. Oh, goodness, you're really here. The Black Sacrament. It actually worked. What I need. What I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. But, well, there is one more thing. If you're interested. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsine Shattershield in Windhelm. Nilsine dies too. Deserved. And I heard about Nilsine. 
You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please, take this as payment and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget you. Ah, you're back. So, how went your first real contract? Now, I need your assistance with a matter of a more... personal nature. It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. You must understand, if Cicero is turning the others against me, against us, our family would not survive such division. Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It will be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. No objections then? Good. Go now, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. Oh, what? Who is the Night Mother? Oh, oh, you jest. <laughs> you jest with gullible Cicero. 